And I think that those are those are that are already on the standby to be funded. Smallholder farmers in the county of Kitui are embracing regenerative agriculture to sustain their farms and improve yields. These sustainable farming practices are transforming lives and enhancing food security in the region. Dennis Oteno reports on this week's Smart Farm. Agriculture is the backbone of many rural economies in Kenya, and Kitui County is no exception. However, farmers in this semi-arid region have long battled climate change, land degradation, and declining soil fertility, threats that continue to challenge food production. But not all farmers are struggling. Some, like Nzomo Mitau, have turned to regenerative agriculture to restore soil health and boost productivity. Regenerative agriculture is a conservation and rehabilitation approach to food and farming systems. On his 11-acre farm in Kilimo village, Kitui West, Nzomo and his wife have diversified into crop farming, beekeeping, poultry and dairy farming, thanks to sustainable practices that have dramatically improved their yields. Oh, the yield from my farm I was getting, I was uh, plowing all the 11 acres, and I was getting uh, just 10 bags, 20 bags at most. Then uh, that was uh, around two bags per acre. But uh, after learning, I changed from plowing uh, those uh, 11 acres, now I just do 4 acres. Hii ni ni regenerative agriculture. Tangu tuyanze. Atusiki kuyacha. Maana tumeona matokeo. Zamani hile tulikuwa tunalima na ngombe. Mvue ikikuja kidogo, hiyo chakula inakauka mapema. Lakini hii, hata mvue ikinyesha kidogo. Chakula hakuna kuoza. Nzomo is among thousands of smallholder farmers benefiting from a project supported by the Eye Care Foundation and implemented by the Cereal Growers Association in Kitui and Makueni counties. We have different methods of uh, training regeneration agriculture. One is a personal, uh, we train personal uh, farmer. We train also group of farmers and also we collaborate with other stakeholders uh, uh, to pass that information to the farmers. Before adopting regenerative farming practices, Zomo's farm was a shadow of what it is today. One, his yields were low, and the soil had been degraded over years of conventional farming. Wakatiyo nilikuwa natumia lanti yangu vibaya, wakatu na itumia mzuri kidogo na napata pesa mingi. Nzomo has now embraced deep tillage, a soil management technique that improves water retention and prevents landslides and floods. He has also dug trenches in strategic locations to harvest and retain water for his crops. These trenches mi ni meweka, ni nataka majio, yote ile napita kwa njia, ingi ndani, inyunyize miti yangu, inyunyize chakule yangu. Kwa hivyo mi nataka iwe kama damu. The important of uh, regeneration agriculture is one uh, is to uh, soil and water harvest technology where you can use now the, the technologies to conserve the water and also the soil for increasing production. And also uh, we do some technical uh, devices and technologies which uh, they conserve the soil and water technology. These methods also promote organic farming by using manure made from the farm animals' droppings to enhance soil health and productivity. The project further supports village-based advisors who help farmers establish agroforestry nurseries with fodder trees and encourage kitchen gardening to boost household fruit and vegetable production. Nzomo and his wife are living proof that sustainable agriculture can enhance productivity, improve livelihoods and build climate resilience. The project aims to reach 20,000 smallholder farmers in four sub-counties across Kitui. According to experts, regenerative agriculture holds the key to enabling farmers adopt sustainable farming practices to enhance soil health, 
increase yields and enable them to combat climate change. Denis Otieno, Smart Farm.